everyone, welcome to DotEZ. Today we'll be introducing DotEZ's website creator and how to create your first website. DotEZ's website creator was developed to be a quick and easy way for our customers to design a professional looking website without any prior website building experience. Now let's get started. So let's log in through the member zone first. Type in your ID and your password and continue to sign in. And on your right hand side, you'll find web tools and you want to select the launch.easy website creator. Um, if it's your first time using the website creator, the link should display um, create.easy website. So we'll click that and it'll give you two different uh, modes, uh, so the simple mode and also the advanced mode for you to choose from. But today we're going to show you how to have your site up and running using the simple mode. So let's select that. So simple mode has pre-built template ready for you to use. Um, it's divided into different categories and also subcategories for your convenience. Um, for today's tutorial, we want to set up a website for a pet shop. So I'm going to go under animals and pets and select pet stores and choose my template and as you can see after you choose the template generic pages with content will be established for you already um, you can change the rename the pages and also delete any unwanted pages as well which I'll be showing you in a bit um, so let's say for whatever reason you don't like the template that you chose, you can always go back to the design website and choose another one from the list that we have here offered. Okay, so let's go back to our page and let's start editing the website by editing our um, name and the slogan of the website. So let's click on the edit page icon and select the edit header so, and click on this. Your input text would be converted into a graphical image which is called gtext for a more uh, professional um, look. So for our name, let's call a hi. And um, I'm going to show you preview this. As you can see, our um, name, the length is too long. It's longer than the width of the image, so it will be cropped. So keep in mind when you're um, choosing your name that you want something will fit. So let's change this to I want a hippo instead and preview that. But it fits, so we're going to select done and select the apply this content to all web pages and click on save. So, yes. Let's take a look. It's been changed on the side over here. So moving on, going back to the edit page icon, we're going to edit our footer next. So select this, edit, and let's change the background color of it. Um, Let's do it pink color. And you can always preview it before you click on save. And it looks like this. Happy with it. So I am going to apply this to all web pages and save. Okay. So let's go back to view page. And this is what it would look like. We will go to the add page next. We can add another page, you can name it here, and we're going to name it uh, questions. Oops, questions and submit. And take a look. So it's been added to the side at the very end over here. And we're going to go to manage pages. This is where we can um, choose to delete and also rename the pages. So I am going to delete the About Us page and I want my visitors to see my products page as my um, home page when they come to the site. Save and I want to rearrange the order of the pages as well. So 
I want the products page to be the first page, home to be the second, and contact us to be the last one, and save. And I want to rename the questions to FAQ. So let's take a look at all the changes that we've made. We deleted the About Us page and also the sequence of the pages are different. Now I want to edit the body of my content. So go back to the edit page. So over here, you can use our text editor uh, without any HTML code um, experience and also knowledge. You'll be able to change the size, the font, and also bold and italicize any of the text. So I am going to change the color of this to a dark green and I'm going to bold this and I also want to add an image page as well. You can upload the image from your own computer or you can use our um, image library from .easy. So I'm going to select animal and choose a kitten. Let's preview this before I save it. So it will look like this. Okay. And click on save. And let's take a look. So it looks like this. So if you have any questions, um, you can always refer to the help button. So you can click on that. Doesn't matter which page you're on, once you select help, it'll show you that specific page you're working on. If our help button was unable to um, solve the questions, um, you can always contact us through .easy, through live chat support, email, or also telephone support. We want to hit publish after you're happy with what you've um, changed. And select yes. And it's just uploading. And click on the launch your website now and finish. All right, so your website is ready for um, the public to view. So thank you for watching this tutorial. If you have any questions, please contact us. And don't forget to like us on Facebook and subscribe to our channel.